Hello Libra and welcome to your Signs from Spirit reading. In this reading we're going to pull some numbers um, that Spirit's going to use to speak to you. We're also going to pull some charms to look at some of the imagery and symbols that Spirit is going to use in the days and weeks that follow this reading to communicate with you, to speak with you, to give you guidance, to let you know you're on the right track or the wrong track. And we're also going to bring in an underlying message that Spirit would like to bring to your attention at this time. So let's get started, Libra, and pull your number. What number is for Libra? Show us Libra. Okay, so you got number 55. So fives, Libra. It's all about the fives for you guys, and it comes with a message of adventure. So with this 55 coming out, Spirit is saying, yes, you've gone through some challenges, but you are about to have a major change. Hold on tight and enjoy the ride, enjoy the journey, enjoy the adventure, because life is about to pick up the pace quite a bit from what it's been, Libra, and um, with these 55 right here, the fives and like 55, 555, five, five, that is a number that Spirit is going to use to let you know that there is a change coming. But also, um, there's going to be a lot of meaning attached to this number. You're going to start seeing it pop up all over the place. And um, sometimes that's just Spirit saying, hey, I'm with you, you're not alone. Or it could be like, yes, you're on the right path. Or it could be, hey, you need to change something about the way you're going about things. And you'll know what the message is of the fives in that moment based on the circumstances and everything going on. So really pay attention when you're seeing fives to everything in the external as well as what you're feeling internally. All right, let's pull an animal spirit and see what animal spirit is working with you and guiding you at this time as well. Okay, so, oh, we don't uh, specifically have an animal. We have pursue and hunting, so um, <clears throat> uh, animal behaviors, so to speak. There's animals in here and then like behaviors and um, places. And so for you guys, spirits like, oh no, let the adventure begin. What do you want, Libra? What do you desire at your core? Now is the time to push forward harder and more motivated than ever because there is a change coming into your life and it's like all the energies are perfectly aligned for you to jump in for you to go for what it is you truly desire in your heart in your soul and it's going to be an adventure absolutely 100 percent it's going to be filled with the thrills and chills and happiness and joy and excitement and i do feel a sense of like you needing to be a bit more spontaneous and quick thinking where um instead of like you know taking a long time to fully weigh out all the different potential outcomes spirit is saying like you're gonna need to just jump in and just go with it and trust yourself and trust the momentum of energy it is time for you to get what you desire libra and what you all are reaching for is something different but the changes needed are now coming into play so that you can pursue all right let's pull some charms and see what other um, images symbols spirits going to use to communicate with you Okay, here is your spirit animal coming through in the charms, the elephant, the wise, the sensitive, the uh, genius elephant. Elephants are very, very smart, Libra, and I'm feeling that for you. Like, you're more intelligent and you're a bigger force 
than you recognize because elephants are definitely a force to be reckoned with, right? They're also very family orientated. They, you know, experience remorse when um, one of their family members passes. And so this animal coming in, the spirit to work with you is a representation of you and who you are and the depth of your sensitivity and sense of family and the wisdom that runs through you and the force that you are like know your power libra next um we have another spirit animal spirit we have the dragonfly coming through and this dragonfly comes with a ring around it and so there is magic libra at hand for you and with this ring around this dragonfly it, to me that's a representation of the magic like there's nothing that can stop it when you choose to pursue you're going to make it happen. It's part of your destiny with this ring. Um, it's part of your uh, contract at your soul for what you signed up for this lifetime. And the dragonfly is coming in representing magic. So I highly recommend doing a Google search to go to the deeper spiritual message of the elephant and the dragonfly because both of these spirits are strong in your experience right now, um, helping you achieve some sort of success here. And next we have the heart. So spirit will use the uh, symbol of the heart to communicate with you. And next we have a key, okay, with another heart. So a key and a heart again. Some stars, cause uh, you are a star in the sky, Libra. Like you are meant to have success. That is the message of this read. and. Um, you guys are just my seventh read. I have um, five more after you, but this is a very different message from the others. And now, um, this looks Egyptian to me, like what's the, the symbolism on it, but to me what this is representing is a passageway for you, Libra. It's there, and behind this door is what you desire, the success that you are reaching for. So, Spirit... In the days and weeks that follow this reading, it's going to um, bring the number 5, 55, 555, five, is going to um, show you the elephant, the dragonfly, heart symbols, um, keys, stars, and gateways, passageways, portals. You're going to just start seeing that, whether it's through like pictures, shows you're watching, um, seeing, you know, like a dragonfly in life, it's going to come to each of you differently. But these are the symbols and the number that spirit is going to be bringing in hard. And when you're seeing these things, um, really stop and take a look around. What are you feeling? What are you thinking? Um, what's the message you feel that these signs and symbols and synchronicities are expressing to you in that moment? Because this is the language of spirit for just you, Libra. And with the key there, as well as the passageway, there is this... Um, big shift and change where you're gonna like your success is gonna feel um, easier to grasp or you outright have the full accomplishment of what you've been after and the heart on um, the heart coming out twice that to me is happiness in the heart space and you know for some of you this absolutely could represent like a new romantic partner like that's the change that's coming into your life okay um, and they're gonna really pursue you or if you're somebody who kind of just holds back and doesn't really put yourself out there, somebody that really interests you comes into your reality, it's time to really pursue that relationship 100% and not second guess yourself and not hold back anything, Libra, that is in your heart because you got the heart times two. Anything that's in your heart that you're really desiring, it's time to pursue that. And as well as allow yourself any sort of change that needs to take place to, um, you know, help the potential of accomplishment or help you out along the journey, along the way. So let's pull some more cards now and go deeper into this message.
Oh, wow. Unexpected treasure. So, look at We've got another heart right there, Libra. You're ruled by Venus, okay? And Venus is the planet of love, of comfort, of luxury. And I see that all over in this reading, okay? There's a lot of happiness coming to the heart space. But I do feel um, spirit coming on so strong, like you have to pursue, you have to pursue, you know, because I definitely am somebody who is like what's meant to be will be, there's no stopping what's meant to be, nor is there anything you could do to make something happen that's just not meant to be. However, there are times when there are um, different inspired actions that we need to take or spirit giving us a sign that we need to go this way or do things this way. And I feel like that's at play for you, Libra. Like you're getting those promptings and you're going to see sign of synchronicity. But it, it, there's like a hesitation inside of you. And it may be like, oh, I don't want to get my heart broke. I don't want to get hurt. I don't want disappointment. I don't want failure. And it, it may cause you to kind of hesitate or second guess or hold back. And spirit's like, no. Go in full force with all of your heart and soul. There's magic. Energy is aligned. It's time for the breakthrough. The star's success. Um, you know, those of you who like want to be more out in the spotlight, I feel um, as you believe in yourself and what you're doing, somebody is going to notice you and see you as a like a, an unexpected treasure. Let me make you a star type of energy. Um, be the key of passage to help you through that gateway. All right, so Libra, your time is now. It is upon you. And open your heart, jump in. Don't second guess yourself at all. And you've got some strong um, animal spirits around you helping with this process. And the elephant, you know, having a strong sense of family and emotion and intelligence, that's what you're aligning to when it comes to another person, okay? Or if it's a, a situation, um, you're going to feel like family in a job um, setting, trying to be out in the spotlight, like all the people coming in, you're going to feel like a family. All right, let's uh, pull another card. Look at that. New path, sign Aries. So as I am doing this reading, this reading is um, a timeless read. But as I do this reading, it is in the um, season of Aries. So that does tell me, Libra, that the time is now. It's time for you to reach out. And with the new path coming through, this is going to be a new success a new ambition, a new relationship, like whatever this is, it's all new energy. It's um, nothing you've had before, nothing you've experienced before. And, um, you know, those of you that want to be out in the spotlight, um, you know, be a star, you're going to find your way. Um, and also with New Path, it's like um, some of you, what do you need to do or what do you need to do different? And if you're confused on that, Spirit will show you. Spirit will bring you the answer, the information. And so the time is now, Libra. Even if you're not watching this in Aries season, um, you're going to be led to this video when the energy is right and conducive for you to really push forward and pursue your dreams and happiness here. Okay, and um, with this also coming through as Aries, this is very long term for Libra. All right, let's pull some transparent oracle and see what comes out there. Look at you, all powerful and strong. You've got another animal spirit coming in 
to work with you. This is a stag and this is a guide to you. This is about leadership and really tapping in to your divine masculine energy, whether you are a male or female, your divine masculine energy is your solar plexus chakra. That's where your power comes from. That's where you manifest from. That's your central sun, Libra. And you're having a big, big um, like burst of energy into that space of you because it is time for success and it is time for you to pursue. And like this is you reaching out, you working towards, you pursuing. And so again, with a relationship, whether you're male or female, as somebody comes across your path, Libra, and you're like really feeling them, don't be afraid to put yourself out there. Okay, because the next card is the element of water, which is all about emotion. And um, you've got to follow that intuition because intuition is, you know, part of the emotional structure, right? You, you just, you feel it in your heart. Um, you feel it in your soul. And so I see the emotion attached to this pursuit and... Um, don't second guess yourself, Libra. Any failures of the past, allow that to heal and see yourself as this strength of the stag, of the elephant, yet possessing the magic and the grace of the dragonfly there. And, you know, with the element of water coming in, this um, goes to me to your sacral chakra because your solar plexus chakra is your fire chakra and your sacral chakra is your water chakra and so your water chakra your creativity your passion your excitement your emotions okay those being um, in full force as well as your inner strength your personal empowerment to achieve to manifest to build so you've got the divine feminine and divine masculine energy both represented which is the energy you need for creation and manifestation and you have it here libra oh my gosh like the time is now for any dream you've ever had to just jump in you know um oh wow and look at the next card would actually be um some fire energy love it there is going to be no better time if you're like well i need xyz um, to happen or to fall. No, the time is now. As you move forward and you pursue, things are going to start happening. Things are going to start falling into place. And if all you can do right now is daydream and make lists and, and, and tentative plans, then do that. Start with where you are right now because you're going to make magic, unexpected treasure, unexpected manifestation, unexpected relationship, unexpected happiness, unexpected success. Those of you trying to be out in the spotlight, somebody is going to notice you and see you. Okay, it's time for you to shine like a star Libra. All right, let's pull your tarot and see what else spirit adds to this message. Reach for them stars, Libra. You will definitely grab one. Okay. So we have strength coming through. And this is the energy of you. Um, some of this pursuit is going to require um, a bit of discipline. Okay, and we do see maybe some change, but man, the energies have never been better for you, Libra, and here it is. Like some of you don't even know what I'm talking about, but this idea is just going to spring forth from deep within you, and the Spirit says follow it, pursue it all the way to the end, or this could um, talk about you as somebody else flirting, um, a strong uh, indication of fire energy. Aries Leo Sag or just uh, the fire energy talking about the sparks and the chemistry that's present between you and this person and now we have the Queen of Pentacles so um, could be some earth energy Taurus Virgo Capricorn but um, this here to me is talking about how you are going to be successful Libra you are going to achieve your goal you're going to make it happen you have everything you need energetically and as you move in that space everything you need in the physical realm is going to start um, manifesting for you because look at here now we have the world and I'll show you that without being stacked 
the world, the completion, and the next card out is the pentacle, the ace of pentacles. So yeah, Libra, what is it that you desire? Um, what is it that you really um, reach for, the success you want? Um, and maybe for some of you, you know, this is just something that you've thought about for a long time and you just, you're like, you know, is this just a pipe dream? Should I pursue this? Could this even happen? And this is like a resounding yes from spirit. Like the time is now. Jump in. Do not be afraid. Do not second guess. You're going to have success. Like you follow this all the way from start to completion, Libra. You are going to have major success here. And you have everything you need. The, um, you know, mental, emotional, and spiritual strength and fortitude, as well as the intelligence and wisdom and knowing and the ability to discipline and keep yourself very structured through the process. And it's going to be so much fun. I just see like this whole process or whatever this is being a bit out of your like norm or your comfort zone. And that's why you may, um, you know, try to second guess yourself or talk yourself out of it. And Spirit's like, no, Libra, you will have success. If in the past you didn't have success, you will have success now. The time is now. You are embarking on a new path, a new um, journey. And some of you, this is like what you needed to give yourself the permission to say, yep, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to try this. I don't care what anybody says or this is a completely different genre of career, but I'm going to pursue it because I feel that calling in my heart, in my soul. And uh, Spirit is going to give you one sign and synchronicity and confirmation after the next, Libra, that you are on the right path. And anything that needs to be changed or tweaked a bit, you're going to become very aware of that and you're going to know what you need to do. It's time for you to have the world in your hands. It's time for you to be a star in manifestation, completion. And remember, a lot of happiness in the heart space, Libra. Um, and it goes beyond, you know, uh, just feeling happy like your cup is full. The way this all unfolds, I feel it expands the heart space, the heart chakra. Um, it, you may be kind of, how do I explain this? When we're really hoping for the best, you know, but we're prepared for the worst case scenario, we're not fully present in something. And um, you may find yourself in that space of like, okay, well, I'm going to give it my all. But I'm going to still kind of hold back in my mind. So if it doesn't work out, I don't get disappointed. And Spirit is saying, you've got to give this your all 100%, 1000% and have no thought of failure in your mind whatsoever. Stay very centered in the heart space. And you're going to see elephants and dragonflies and hearts and keys and stars, Libra, just encouraging you on and 55 and fives, five, five, five. And you know, fives are all about change, but this is change for the good. And the water here is card 23, which would be another five. So a big change and shift coming to the emotional body, some healing coming in, a restoration of motivation and excitement because Libra, it is time to pers pursue what it is you desire the most because everything is lined up for the success of that at this time. So let's pull one final message. Butterflies. Whenever you see a butterfly flutter through the grass, it is to remind you of the love of those who have passed. So butterflies also coming into play here, but a message from passed on loved ones, Libra, they are also around you and encouraging you. And when you see a butterfly, that is your passed on loved one letting you know, hey, I'm with you. Hey, you're on the right path. Hey, things are about to change for you good positive manifestation, success and luck and magic is on your side, Libra. 
take advantage of this energy and pursue your dreams. Those are your messages. I am sending you lots of love and light. Take care.